Hey guys, we're Kit and Lee, and welcome back to Life Lemons Travel. Welcome to our Georgia series, The Country, Not the State. In this episode, we'll be leaving Kitaizi, Georgia's third and oldest city, and the place we've called home for the last couple of weeks. We'll take our first Georgian train journey to the capital, Tbilisi. Hit the subscribe button to show your support and stay in the loop for future shenanigans. <laughs> so we're leaving the apartment that we've been in for two weeks. Two weeks, two whole weeks. It has felt like home, very much so. Just give the camera one last look while I carry the boom bags out. <laughs> So glam. Yeah, so ah. this morning we're saying goodbye to Kataisi and we're making our way to the capital city of Tbilisi. Woo! Hey. Um, first things first, we're going to head out and get some coffee and some breakfast. I'm and, hungry. Yeah, and then we'll tell you a little bit more about the journey and how we're getting to Tbilisi along the way. <laughs> How am I going to get this under the mat now? I don't know, it's going to be fun to watch though. <laughs> you got to hold on to see get back to that. I would take something off you, but that would be far too easy. That was the hard bit. <laughs> My bum hurts from the, the park gym yesterday. <laughs> and heave. <laughs> well. Gonna see if our friend was here for one last goodbye. Oh, but he's not here. Can't see her anywhere. Oh, it's probably a good thing because we'd only be late and miss the train. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Let's go and ditch this rubbish. Another absolutely glorious morning in Kataisi. We've had a few rainy days, but overall the weather's been absolutely gorgeous. It has, hasn't it? Which after a very long hot summer in Greece, we're a little bit concerned about what the weather might be like. Um, but it's been absolutely beautiful and actually reminded us some very lovely, pleasant summer days back in the UK. Yeah, yeah, very similar. Well, when they occur, obviously, which is rare. <laughs> <laughs> is it this one? There's an old tyre in there, it must be that one. Not yet. Not yet. Running on the roads, please. <laughs> Be safe. How nice is the It's so nice. I don't say that when it's raining, though. <laughs> <laughs> so I have no idea if it was intentional, but the accommodation that Kit booked for the last two weeks is actually only a 10 minute walk from the train station, which is how we're getting to it. To Lee, nothing I do is intentional. <laughs> Everything's an accident. Okay, it's a happy yeah. accident. When we were in the first accommodation, we discovered this little place as we were walking into town one day. It's a lovely little coffee shop and bakery. It's called Lafayette. Lafayette. We're looking to get a table. Yeah, it's always busy. Should we try and I'll take one of everything, please. <laughs> so will I. It's still slightly warm as well, probably. Some cheesy bread. Absolutely delicious. Two poppies and two pieces of cheesy bread, like that big. It came to about six pounds. Pretty good. They like the size of garden patio slabs as well, which is good. <laughs> I'm gonna let my uh, my little man bag decide the fate of whether we get a cake or not because if I've got four uh, Larry and change in the bottom of here then one of those cakes is happening. Right. The cost 
Americans here are a bit weird. You just have to kind of step out when there's a gap. Like, don't alarm anyone. Wait till there's a gap <laughs> and then step out. This is a big one though, and there's no. I think we're going to now. Yeah. Oh. Uh, no, no, no. They're coming from every direction, mate. <laughs> I don't know when's I, a good time. I think now's a good time. Out. Yeah. Anyway guys, so yeah, we're just walking now. We've had our coffee and our cheesy bread. Uh, we're just a few minute walk away from the train station. I think I can see the stairs up ahead to it actually. Oh my God, that's a lot of stairs with these bags. There's a lot of stairs, I'll show you in a moment. So yeah, we're going from central Kutaisi to Tbilisi, which is about five and a half hours. It costs us five pounds 50 roughly about, uh, for both of us. Wow. It was about, about 19 lorry. Um, for two tickets for five and a half hour train wow. we've got reserved seats so our train is about midday gets us into Tbilisi about half past five this afternoon there is a shorter option for the train which is about three and a half hours which is from Riona station which is about a 20 minute taxi ride out of Kataisi. out of Kataisi. Um I think it's a little bit more expensive and obviously you'd have to get a taxi there but if you want to save time on your journey that's one way to do it. Not ideal oh when, uh, when you've got two big backpacks on you. Come on, Kit, keep up. <laughs> this is the train station. I think it's the train station anyway. It looks like it. You didn't look too bad after doing those steps. I always look good, Lee. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Steps will be wow. the death of Kitty today. I'm running out of energy. We can get to the top of the ears and hopefully that's the last one and then we're done. Five and a half hours where we get to sit down on the train. Yeah. Good for me. Sarah's been good for me. <laughs> 28, 29, yeah. That's the big steps with a big bag on. Not that big. Do you know? Mind the step. I think they'll some will definitely fit above as well. Hi Paul. <laughs> oh hello Paul. <laughs> Is it outside? 28, 29. Oh my god, we're not together. Are we not? No. One's here, but one's here. Okay, we're on separate sides of the aisle. I'm sitting right here. Okay, we'll figure it out. You're not putting your big bag up there, are you? Yeah, I think there's space, space down where you are, look. Yeah, there is a bit. So sorry, let, let me put my bag in there, Lou. There we go. <laughs> I feel very <violent>. late. <laughs> Cool. Oh, that there. cool. Space, space. Awesome. Perfect. Yeah, there's way more space on here than there was on the Bangkok night train. If you saw that episode, there was no space on the back so bad. What are we here? 29.30? Yeah. Yeah, it's weird that they've put us on like separate sides, but... It's like Ryanair, isn't it? They, they sit you separately just because you haven't paid for a seat. There yeah. wasn't an option to pay for a seat here, was there? They did just, just automatically assign you them, yeah. Like, you don't, you don't pay. <laughs> it's really rude. <laughs> well, it's quite comfy and there's plenty of room. Yeah, there is. Look at that. All this room for activities. So many activities. Cool. It's 11.55. Train has left bang on time. Wow. In England that doesn't happen. 
you see our trains are so expensive <laughs> and they're so poorly run in England, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Don't miss that. So far, so good. We've just realised though that we haven't got a bloody view <laughs> where we're sat. <laughs> it looks pretty out there. Yeah, so we're gonna have to stand up to uh, to get some views out the window for you, but no problem. see what the toilet's like. <laughs> Wish me luck. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Uh, are you getting out now? Yeah. Had the toilet was. Oh. One guy pointed towards the toilet and then the other guy said no station. So Oh wow, so there might not be a toilet. I'm gonna have a look. One guy pointed to a toilet, so Oh wow, okay. Yeah. Yeah, go for one day. Yeah. Well, I don't know what that's all about. I've just seen a guy come out of this toilet, so I'm gonna use it. How good is that? Wow. <laughs> it's going to be quite difficult, isn't it? Honestly, do we get a credit card out? No. Nah. Like a spoon? No. Nah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's like jelly mousse, it's weird. No, but it's weird. No, it's a bit weird. The top bit's the best the bit, that's, that's the definite bit. The chocolate there on the top is the best. Most people are going that way, aren't they? I've eaten too much cheese, Lee. <laughs> Kit's, regretting her, well. Kit's regretting her life choices at the moment I from eating, eating too much cheesy bread. I think we've just got to get on the metro for a few stops. Well, we've come out of Tbilisi Central Station, turned right, and about 100 metres away is Station Square. that cost me. Slightly too. Yeah, it's 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 so quick <laughs> So we just went one station too far and then had to get off and get back on the one going the other way back to the one we had to get off, up at and we almost missed it again because we were just like proper chilling. <laughs> It was just one tap of the card to enter, cost 42p for the journey. Is that all? I'm going to put this down so I can figure out where we're going. It's 
So guys, we just got to our accommodation in Tbilisi. We were just greeted by Ashen, who guided us the right way because we didn't exactly know where it was. This is it. This is nice. And then we've got a cool little balcony area too. Absolutely perfect. Got this place for two nights. Probably about half six now in the evening. So we've got a full day in Tbilisi tomorrow. It's nice to huh, take the bag off. After checking into our apartment, which we're really happy with, we've just been chilling for like the last hour. Uh, nothing crazy tonight. We're just going to go out locally, find some nice food and have a fairly relaxed evening. We'll show you what we eat tonight, but other than that, it's going to be a fairly quiet night. So, anything to add, Kit? Um, I gotta get me some food. <laughs> <laughs> Preferably something that's not beige, because we've just lived off cheesy bread today. <laughs> I'm going to eat bread and dessert and get all fat and sushi. <laughs> <laughs> you were being serious. <laughs> <laughs> you can get like cheaper accommodation in Tbilisi, but it was mostly hostels. I think we just, you know, with what we've got planned, which we'll reveal more in the morning, because uh, we've not really told you the whole reason why we're coming to Tbilisi yet. One fun fact is that we're only in Tbilisi for one day. Yeah. I think I already did say two nights earlier. So. Fair enough. One day, two nights. So yeah, I think we just wanted to basically have our own space where we can get our stuff out and prepare and make sure we've got everything we need sorted for Sunday. I just wanted to add to that the price of this place. This is based on what our tour guide Saba said the other day but generally you're looking at almost double aren't you of the prices of accommodation in Tbilisi compared to Kataisi. Yeah so this is what seven pounds per person per night yeah which is pretty which is obviously it's really good it is really good um, but for the same price we got an entire apartment in Kataisi. Yeah there you go so learn from the locals is to hold the knob hold the knob as we, <laughs> as we call it hold the bit of uh, pastry at the top eat it upside down take a bite and then essentially tip the juice out of it if you've got a really hot one then you bugger <laughs> 